Hey guys, welcome back to the plant-based kitchen. You're watching prep school and I'm going to teach you one of my favorite tricks that I've picked up when I'm trying to study all the different cooking techniques so I can try to become a chef. So I'm going to share that with you and I don't know if you guys are like me, but my eyes are actually pretty sensitive to onion. Like growing up, if my mom was cutting an onion, I'd be crying across the house. Like I could always tell if there was onion in the air. So I'm going to show you how to cut an onion without crying. So the trick here with this is when I started cooking, I always cut the onion this way, sideways. And that is what makes you cry because it severs through the root. But if we flip it this way and cut a along with the root, it actually saves you from getting all that onion juice, airborne, hence the crying. So we're gonna cut it this way to start with and then we can do our business. So go ahead and slice straight down through your onion, slicing it exactly in half and you can see that root is kept intact. Then you're going to flip your onion face down. Now the opposite end from the root, I still like to cut that guy off because it's a little bit hard and it's not great texture. Now, if you feel like the outside of your onion needs to be peeled a little bit more, go ahead and do that. I usually like to take off a layer or two. Now, what you're gonna do to get a nice fine dice on this is you're going to add straight down a bunch of different chops and get as close to the root as possible without actually slicing through. You can see all of our slices following that root grain and then we're going to run and make our additional slices to get a nice fine dice on here. Now if you are making a recipe that calls for super super fine dice you can add another slice in here at an angle and you can see it's already falling off and then we can continue with our slicing. So go ahead run your knife down over it and go ahead and take your fingers and pinch together the layers to keep it intact while you slice down. Be sure to watch your fingers and tuck your fingers under. So if you were to get up on your finger, it glides back down your knuckle. It doesn't actually cut into your finger. So be sure to pinch those together, slicing downwards. You can see we're getting a nice fine dice on this. Now I actually like to take this pretty close to the root and to even save more waste, you can flip the root back on its head, add a couple more slices in and around the root. You can see we've really avoided a lot of waste on that. If you want an even finer dice than this, you can always run your knife back over. But honestly, this is good enough and I add onion to almost everything I cook with. It just adds so much flavor. It's so easy, so delicious and there you go. That is how to cut an onion without crying. If you guys wanna check out any more of my prep school videos, you can go ahead and click or tap the screen to check them out. Thanks so much for watching. Goodbye.